Welcome to the Staples Center in Los Angeles, California. I'm Kevin Calabro alongside Marcus Johnson sitting courtside. What about this matchup tonight, Marcus? Kevin, we need to just cut out all the chit-chat and get right to the game because it looks like these two teams are raring to go out there. Thanks, Marcus. To the floor now for player introductions. The Los Angeles Lakers would like to welcome you to tonight's game. Please be advised of league rules and follow all stadium regulations. We hope you enjoy your evening. Tonight's starting lineups for the visiting Philadelphia 76ers. Starting at guard, 6'3", from Michigan State, Eric Snow. Starting at forward, 6'7", from Georgia Tech, Matt Harpray. Starting at forward, 6'10", from Syracuse, Derek Coleman. Starting at center, 7-2 from Georgetown, Dikembe Mutombo. And starting at guard, 6 feet from Georgetown, Allen Iverson. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for, it's our Los Angeles Lakers! Starting at guard, 6-1 from Arkansas Little Rock, Derek Fisher. Man, I'm going to stop. Starting at forward, 6-7 from North Carolina, Rick Fox. Here's the opening tip. Opening tip controlled by the Lakers. got up over everybody and threw it down. What a terrific leaper. I mean, literally, he just elevates Five his second game. Five second violation on the inbound. Ball goes over. You, you really got to get the ball in. I mean, you might as well just throw it up. At least you've got a chance to turn over either way you cut it. Yes. See, that's a big man's special weapon, that little sky hook over the defense. It's tough to defend against it. Five, Five second violation on the inbound. Ball goes
Standby, 1010, investigate a reported disturbance at Acer Plaza. 10-4, dispatcher, verify address. That's Acer Plaza, repeat, Acer Plaza. Shots fired on the rooftop. An assault in progress at Acer Plaza. Repeat, an assault in progress. Shot was an exclamation mark to everything that had led to this point. I released my finger from the trigger, and then it was over. My beret was stirred nervously under my coat. The train doors had already shut behind me, and I was in for the ride. Next stop, Roscoe Street Station, and Alex. The station was drenched in gloom. Alex was a ghost, nowhere to be seen. I'd have to look for him. Death was in the air at Roscoe Street. I'd have to find Alex fast. Getting around, you hear me? What is this a joke? Hey, anybody? Hey. The security panel led on a mocking cackle. 
I'd need the right code. What was that? It's nothing. Relax. Power to the rail had been cut. I'd have to get it back on to get the train moving. Kiss it goodbye. No! Oh! You saved me, man. What's going on here? A massacre. These armed thugs just appeared from nowhere. We need to get help. I can make the call from the control room one floor up. Can you take me there? Sure. Sounds good. Follow me. We gotta get moving, please! Home free. This way. Look out! like a Christmas tree. Power was back on.
One way or the other, I was going to find out. Spooky. Jack Lapino, yeah, spooky. But also, it's like the failure count is rising. Yeah, I wouldn't joke about it if I was you. Yeah. The station's not secured. Someone decided to play hero upstairs. That's all we need. Done here. Give me the detonator. What are you talking about? The detonator. I thought you'd bring it. You were supposed to bring it. Yeah, right. The door had been shut ages ago. I was missing a detonator. Okay, fellas, the police are on their way. New York's finest, they're gonna be here soon. So stick to the plan. We've got our own private exit route. In and out, do your thing. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am.
Bank robber score lay on the table. Bank robbers had left their tools on the table. Judging by the detonators, the crooks had bought enough explosives to send Lady Liberty into orbit. Alex? Alex! There was nothing I could do. He was dead. I could tell by the empty, accusing stare of his eyes.
approximately 2200 hours on Wednesday, December 29th. Our facilities at approximately 2200 hours. didn't come here to get involved but listen up I don't have much time I know you didn't come here to get involved but listen the chief's on to you he sent his cronies get out of here this obviously isn't going to be a cakewalk watch yourself up here
Yo, 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 all right. Let's get this party started. I'll be your audience, so let's see what you got. Mm -hmm. Someone done stole the goddess of the streets, the statue of Dogen Zaka Hill. I bet the punks who did this are the same ones who are spreading all them nasty rumors. Cover Dogen Zaka Hill in graffiti and flush out those rumors spreading scumbags.
Huntington Beach. The waves today are head high with an occasional six-footer coming in. Choppy with a lot of sections out front. The water is cold. The tide is high. This place reminds me of a time that's way too old. These times of gallery. All right. It's all about you, Drew. Hey, everybody. So I'm Jason. I'm one of the co-founders of Bungie and the lead on Halo. I've got Joe Staten with me here. Uh, he's our director of cinematics. Joe's done some pretty cool Halo movies of the PC version of the game. Hi, I'm John Howard, I'm lead game designer on Halo. And I'm Jamie Graysmer, and I'm a designer. Okay, uh, and we're going to talk to you a little bit about uh, what's going on here, what's, why we think this game is...
Hi, I'm Steve Abeta. I'm an uh, animation and uh, environment lead on Halo. I'm Shikai Wang. I'm an artist for the Halo team. And uh, you can see here, this is Halo in action. Uh, I'm one of the monks. I also write the music for Halo and uh, work on the sound design. I'm Marty O'Donnell. This is my little friend. All right. Bigger than you think, O'Donnell. <laughs> uh, Joseph Stanley. Hi, so my name's Alex Seropian. I'm a uh, founder of Bungie. Hi, I'm uh, Hamilton Chu. I'm producer on Halo. This is Halo. We've been working on this game for oh, a little over three years now. This is a project we started after Mythfall and Lords came out. And uh, it's actually, it's evolved 